Routines are very important for me as a homemaker. I start my morning off with my prenatals and lots of water and make sure I stay hydrated and I just like getting up by like 6.30 for sure and getting my day going with a prayer journal and reading God's word and that just really sets the day off well. And of course, um, having a cup of coffee as well is a must for me. Even being pregnant, I have one cup of coffee in the morning. And then um, just having some conversation with my husband as well. So truly just having a routine as a homemaker helps make the day feel like it's going to start well. And um, then after breakfast is all done and my husband's off to work, I do morning stretches and a little bit of preparation for giving birth. And so I think that's important for me as well, just to stay flexible, to stay prepared for what labor is looking like. And um, I have been doing a lot of breathing and stretches and um, things to get ready for birth. If you want to know more about that, I can make a video on that. But then um, I had to add some homemade whipped cream to my coffee this time and let my little one have a lick of the whisk. And I think that's just something fun that she can experience and remember. But my days are sometimes very similar and I think that's okay as a homemaker. We just have to find the joy in the small things um like right now folding laundry my daughter is potty trained now at about 21 months and she found her little underwear and she thought she needed to put those underwear on top of her other underwear but you know that's just something kind of fun to see and know like hey that's cool that she learned to do that and um just experiencing that but every day we fill our berkey because we do like to drink our filtered water and I do love our Berkey water filter. Um, I also love using my diffuser. I use Young Living essential oils and just depending on the scent I want, how I'm feeling that day. Today was a purification, so the fresh air and then some lemon. And I just kind of like to make up my combination sometimes. Okay, and then I needed to use up some bananas and make some banana bread. Now I kind of made up this recipe. I didn't have enough bananas, so I used a sweet potato, applesauce, maple syrup, whole wheat flour. Um, and I've started to have my daughter help in some of these areas. I just think that's important as a homemaker too, is to train them. I've talked about this before, but train your kids when they're young to do things that are productive and helpful in the home and that's just something that I need to be okay with because sometimes I don't like messes but messes happen more often when little ones do help and so I just think that watch as I watch this it's just a joy to see her watching and learning as I make the banana bread and she helped stir. definitely find joy in changing up the decor of my home and for this winter season I did order some new pillow covers from Amazon. I can link them in the description box. Also you can check out my winter home tour in the description box as well if you haven't seen it. But I just think that's a way we can love our home and change out um, just what it looks like and to make us feel good about our homes that we've done something for a different season. And then vacuuming. I don't do this daily, but it is probably twice a week, twice, three times a week, depending on how many crumbs, how dirty the floor looks, and I just, I really enjoy vacuuming. I don't know. If you have carpet and you see the fresh lines, do you like it? Don't you like it? I don't mind seeing the lines of vacuums. Um, and then dishes. Okay, I have a dishwasher but I do dishes probably almost after every meal. I know some of you are thinking, oh, that's crazy, and when you get more kids, it's not gonna work. But I love having an empty sink and being ready for just the next meal. And so 
I definitely don't mind doing my dishes and my daughter doesn't mind when I'm doing them either. Um, okay, so I always prep for suppers during my daughter's nap time. I just find that really helpful and I do that. That is a daily task I do. And today I am making a Thai chicken enchilada bake. Um, I did follow a recipe, but I also did make it up a little bit too. Like I said in previous videos, I don't ever fully <laughs> follow the recipe the way it says. But um, I love the doing this as a daily task, cooking and homemaking in this way and preparing food for my family. And I find joy in it. I really do. I've really enjoyed becoming a better cook and baker when I am home and can do that. <laughs> also something definitely enjoyable to me about clean sheets and remaking the bed. I wash my sheets once a week for sure um, and just remake it and I just love climbing into fresh sheets at night and that's again something that brings me joy and is not a daily task again but a weekly task and so whatever you can find during your day that brings you joy I really highly recommend finding those little things in your homemaking that bring you joy. This year I really have been working on decluttering, minimizing, and simplifying my home. And again, I am going through some of my clothes and just getting rid of things I really just don't like how they fit on me, don't enjoy wearing them, they have some pilling, you know, just all those little things that I really don't need to keep if I only wear them once a year, I don't really need them. And so I'm just being pretty hardcore here and trying to get only one container for my off-season clothes under the bed and I did get that I achieved that and that's so exciting to me and there's just so many outfits that I already have that I realized I wear weekly and so I don't need to keep a lot of outfits if I'm just kind of rotating the same things and so I have a lot more donations here that I will be giving or giving some stuff to my sisters because they were all about similar size so um, after I do a lot of decluttering that afternoon, I prep the table for a supper. I love using linen napkins and getting the table set and um, having those fresh flowers on the table. During the winter season, I definitely have a fresh bouquet of flowers every week. And typically I just buy them from Aldi or Walmart. And I just love having that pop of color on the table when the days and nights are dreary in the January, February months for sure. Um, but homemaking is so enjoyable, especially when you're serving your family food. Even if it's a simple salad on the side and these delicious enchiladas, by the way, or whatever I said, they were Thai enchiladas, yes. But um, the joys of sitting down as a family to me is so important and special, and I recommend that to you if you can. Sit down with your spouse, your boyfriend, your girlfriend, your children, your family, and enjoy a meal together. Um, and then this sometimes has been a daily task because of my little one on the potty. I do wipe down the bathroom almost daily and just use um, a microfiber cloth and some bathroom spray and just kind of wipe things down just so it's fresh for the next day. It does take um, some effort to do this but really was only about five minutes worth of wiping some stuff down and keeping it clean and that way it's ready for a new day of using the potty chair so i do swiffer dry swiffer my floor once a day but i do this floor wet mop 
about three times a week and yes I know it's gonna get dirty the next day with food spills dirty shoes whatever happens but it's just nice again to refresh and restart in the evening for the next day and instead of doing it in the morning when I'm wanting my morning routine I just like to get it done in the evening um, and then I did a nice quick bath and got my jammas on and just lit some candles to have a relaxing evening. And I also have to mention, um, my husband wanted you to know, I did have some of this ice cream here and it is so delicious. <laughs> and so I hope you feel inspired today to find joy in your daily tasks as a homemaker. Love you guys. Mm-hmm.